Um, for you guys that's having a problem with the MAS um, Plus uh, Android TV box, as you can see here, here's my quick fix for that. Um, what you want to do is once you turn your box on, you connect your Wi Fi or your internet, you want to go into settings really fast. You go over to applications, you locate applications, you go over to your Kodi, you click on that. Once your code is um, highlighted, you go to say where it says clear data. Once you clear your data, you should be left with zero um, Bs. This means your Kodi box is actually cleared and completely empty. You come over here and you locate your Kodi. You click on that. It loads up. Once it loads up, you go over to systems. You come down to file manager. Once you're in file manager, you click on add sources once you're in add sources you want to actually put it in exactly as I have it here HTTP colon forward slash forward slash SPINZ TV repo dot com forward slash then you want to give it a name you click actually you click OK and then you go to this section where you want to give it a name. You give it a name spins or whatever name you want to, that way you can remember. You come down, you click OK. Once you click on OK, you come out of that. You come out of OK, then you go back to systems, you click on systems, you come to add-ons, you click on add-ons, you agree with this message, you click OK. Once you click OK on this message, you go to where it says install from zip. You click on install from zip and you locate the name that you just gave it, which I gave my spins. You click on spins. Once you click on spins, you should have these four. You should have the fire stick and repositories and you should also have plugin program spins TV 1.1.0. You click on that. Once you click on that, give it a few seconds and in the right hand corner, after a minute or so, you should see Spins TV enable. Just give it a minute. It usually takes about roughly about a minute and a half or so. So let's just give it a minute and see what happens here. You might want to be a little patient on this one. As you can see right here, it says Spins TV add on enable. Once that's done, you will be greeted with this message. Currently, there's no bills installed. You go to where it says um, bills menu. Click on OK. Give that about 35 seconds or so. And here you are. The one that I like the most is Spins um, TV Premium. You have two choices to download from. I like to pick the second one. You highlight that and you click on OK. You give it a minute. And it says working right here. And you can go to where it says fresh install. Click on fresh install. Give that about a minute or so. Then you click on yes to continue. And once you click on yes to continue, it should actually continue the process of installing your new build. There it is. It's clearing the files. Your current setup for Kodi has been cleared. Click on OK agree and install and it's now currently installing Spins TV you can sit back relax I'm gonna take you to the home video because I'm not gonna cut it uh, just so you guys can see how the process is really done this should take anywhere from about maybe like four to five minutes all depends on your internet speed so let's just sit back and relax and watch it from scratch.
So as you guys can see, we're currently installing the build right now. Um, the box is actually not bad. It comes pre-installed with um, YouTube, Netflix, Facebook app, Twitter app, Skype, and all that other stuff you can actually access at the front menu. This box is also um, 4K Ultra HD. Um, the box is not bad for the price. It actually helps out when you want to cut cable costs. So for me, I am all about cutting cable costs. So it's a pretty good box. Uh, when you first receive this, well, for me, when I first received this box, about 90% of the repositories really didn't work at all. So for me, that was not very helpful. But I know how to fix it, so that that makes it a lot easier for me so I'm hoping I'm sharing this video with you guys that's having the same problem that way that you guys wouldn't feel frustrated and you know feel like you purchase a box and nothing on the box works so it the box does work you just have to know what to do and how to install certain things to get it to work because when I purchased this box when we received this box as a matter of fact a lot of the repositories that's um, actually installed on the box is outdated. So it leads me to believe that the box was done, but the way they set it up, it wasn't up to date. So a lot of the repositories really don't work. But if you guys follow these instructions, just the same way that I laid it out, I guarantee you, you will have a box that's working perfectly. And you guys won't be disappointed. Guarantee you. So right now we are at 69%. We have about a minute and a half. Well, close to two minutes remaining. So this is going to be. It's going to be pretty fast. And we're not going to cut anything on this video. So you guys can see that. The whole process from the beginning to end how this is done so you have about a minute and a half remaining and once the repository and the once spin steve is actually downloaded it'll take about another 45 seconds up to a minute or so to actually extract the build and you will see the big difference in what spin steve does compared to the way that the box comes once this is all finished. So right now we are at 89% with about 40 seconds left. And we're moving along. We have about a good 15 seconds remaining on this particular um, installation. Uh, once it reaches zero, you will be greeted with another message that's about to, well, not a message. Actually, as you can see right now, it's actually extracting the build. And we're at 6%. And it's moving along much faster than it did once we started to download And there's no editing in this, it's just straight. No editing whatsoever, it's just straight up, this is how you do it, this is how it's done, this is the process, this is the length of time that it takes. All you guys need to have is a little bit of patience. And like I said, you won't be disappointed. We're at 38%.
right now we're at 67% and moving along we should be done momentarily and you guys will get to see what Spins TV is all about eighty one percent ten percent remaining and we should be just about finished all we have to do once the box well once the Spins TV is installed. You will be greeted with another um, another message, letting you know that it's been installed. And in order for you to get everything to work, you have to reboot your system. So we're at ninety nine percent right now. So this message should be coming up within about thirty seconds or so. To save your changes, now you need to force close Scotty. Press OK. You press 